Hey there YouTube, it's the Black Natural Plant Based Mama and today we're making cauliflower fried rice. First thing we want to do to make our cauliflower rice is cut up a head of cauliflower, put it in the blender, fill that blender with water. And as you can see, I've got it on the highest. This is just my regular, not my high speed blender. And then you just pulse it a few times, just like that. And as you can see how quickly it is changing down into the cauliflower rice. I did this twice, so I ended up making two batches. And then I just basically strained it on out. I didn't have the sieve. I thought I did, I can't find it. So we work with what we've got. Pour all of that out. See how it's all riced up? Woohoo! All right, next up is basically just pressing it down and getting some of the water. See all that water there? And getting that out. Pressing some more. And I ended up getting it pretty packed down in there. Um, so it was a good amount of cauliflower rice that came up to go with this. Next up, we are putting it in the pan into a frying pan. And it's a pretty deep uh, prop frying pan. So I got quite a bit there. And this is to cook and feed for the whole family. And whatever the rice won't do, cauliflower rice that is, I will make sure to bulk up with other things. So then basically I just keep stirring it around. Um, it's on actually pretty high heat because as the cauliflower is cooking, it is releasing more water. So I've got it up on a pretty high heat, almost high, just one knot from high basically. Um, and just keep stirring it around. I'm adding some Beyond Chicken, some of the coleslaw. That's going in a separate pan right next to it. Um, so I cut up the Beyond Chicken strips into chunks. And I'm cooking that in a pan over pretty high heat as well with, it was about half of the bag of the coleslaw mix. And so as you can see here, almost like a DJ, we're making some music with dinner and we are going back and forth. So you can see that steam really coming off of there. It's starting to stick a little bit at the bottom. However, it's still releasing water. So there was no need to even add oil and plus it is a non-stick pan. So I'm just keep stirring and back to my other turntable. Next up, we've got soy sauce. I added probably about a tablespoon in with the cabbage mixture and the Beyond Chicken. Stirred that around so that everything got coated very well. And then also did the same thing over in my rice. Now that was probably about three tablespoons because it was a pretty big batch of cauliflower rice. Like I said, that was two heads of cauliflower that are in that pan. And as you can see, it's been all distributed. So I had two bags of the steamed broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots, and then without the juice, some pineapple chunks. So we made it kind of a Thai style fried rice. Put everything together, added more seasonings, five spice, garlic, onion powder, and ta-da, that is what we have. I added a little bit of sesame oil, and that is our super delicious dinner. Sprinkle some sesame seeds and some sriracha sauce. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the button, and I'll see you soon.